Welcome to T Cloud Linux Administration Training Course Demo. Before I go across with the demo of the topics, let's go with the summary of what all we provide in the training. The course content is going to be around 15 hours. Uh, we do have the infrastructure and the lab setup where you can actually practice all this uh, Linux based stuff. We have uh, we do provide online as well as tutorial based uh, trainings whereas you can uh, basically come to the class and you can uh, sit in front of the tutor and you can learn it if not you can sit right at your home where you will be provided the access uh, where you can actually go through the uh, course right from the home uh, we do provide the notes so whatever we teach in the class we have the same notes uh, way back uh, and you can basically uh, we provide that in the form of the PDFs where you can start reading it. Um, whatever the classes we take daily, we do actually record them. So they are the computer-based tutorials. So at any point of time, if you feel like reading them again, uh, you can uh, you can walk to the office, you can basically go to the tutorials. If not, you can actually take a slot wherein you can uh, log in at a particular point of time and you can go through the tutorials. Uh, so this is basically the summary that I wanted to provide about uh, the training that we brought from T-Cloud. That said, let's coming, uh, come back to the course content. So initially, in this particular module, we'll be covering about installation. We'll be covering about various installation methods like CD-ROM, Pixie-based, uh, NFS-based, HTTP-based, and Kickstart, and these all stuff. Then we'll be coming to the system installation and services where we learn about how a system boots. Um, what are the various steps that happen while the system is booting, what are the things that we need to take care of while the system is up and running. Then we'll come to kernel services and configuration. In the kernel services and configuration, we learn about what do you mean by the various kernels, what do you mean by kernel, how do you load the modules, how do you unload the modules, what is the basic configuration part that you need to do across. Then we'll come to the file system management where we learn to create the file systems. Then we'll come to the network configuration where we learn about how to create the network stuff and everything. Uh, then we come to RPM and Kickstart, which is an extension of uh, uh, installing your package that is called Red Hat Packet Manager and YAM installations. Then in the user administration, we learn about um, an advanced parts of how to create users, how to create groups, what you mean SUID, SGID, and sticky bit. Unit 8, we learn about bit of administrative tools, like how do you connect to the client side and bit of printers. Unit 9 is more to do with the X-Window system, uh, which is more how do you work with your graphical user interface and so on. And Unit 10 is advanced file system management, which is, uh, again, uh, an extension of your unit number 4 of a file system where we learn about LVMs and RAID. And Unit 11 is a troubleshooting, which is a way of how do we troubleshoot each and every instance. Like if there's an issue with the installation, how do you troubleshoot it? There's some issue with a particular booting sequence, how do you troubleshoot it if there is some issue again with some loading of the modules, how do you work out with it? Something like you created a file system but you are not able to see it, or if you created a file system you are not able to mount it, how do you do that is what you learn in file system. Um, troubleshooting, then we come to network configuration where you learn about what are the troubleshooting that you need to do in the network areas, RPM and the during the installation, what are the issues. So. Uh, your troubleshooting as a whole covers the complete troubleshooting area of all the 10 chapters that we are going to cover here. Uh, so this is the complete uh, uh, demo of the Linux administration training. Uh, and thank you for going through the video. Hope you subscribe.